Yeah. Oh. Hello, to the man of the show, my special one for fourteen. Yay! Whoa! So, ladies and gentlemen, last episode was indeed the start of the second half of the season. Well, what can I say, man? I am just so excited for the second half because you can see from the opening reaction, I am so hyped to see Aria or should I say the Demon Lord versus the Spider Kumoko. Oh my God, dude! That will be the epic, most epic part of the season, for my, in my opinion, because you know the Demon Lord versus Kumoko, Kumoko so OP, and of course, most importantly, we're gonna see when will she turn to the Arcane mode too. So, oh my God, dude, this is gonna be a very lit second half of the season, and of course, you have to deal with you know some human politics and stuff like that too. But I only care about Kumoko's side, man. Although you can say she managed to escape the Libriath now and stuff like that, she can go explore the world now. At what cost? Well, her head from her family, if her family wants to kill her for disobeying them, especially the mother. But you know. In the end, Kumoko is too OP for them. She basically went full Gilgamesh mode and killed most of the family members, and now she's sending her mind clones to attack the mother. So, well, let's just see how that go for today, of course. But today, let's just see whether she's gonna meet another new character because apparently, according to the what I can see from the PV for today's episode, we will see some new characters today. So that's it. Let's get started, reaction, shall we? Okay, that girl has some weird eyes, man. Well, I guess we get to see what Kumiko has in offer for her next mission, I guess. No, you let your own clone attack the mother. <laughs> no, and I thought I know that that pose low. Oh, hey, it's the character from before. Okay, so it's from 15 years before. Okay, so they're fighting up bandits, I see. I mean, be the hero of the situation and help them out, Kumiko. Dude, just help them for God's sake. I know you're a monster, but still. Dude, you can easily slaughter them, man. Hmm. <laughs> oh, wow. Holy shit. No, cannibalism. Come on, man. Okay, because because there's a baby, then he will be... Okay. Oh! There goes the driver. Yes! Thank you, Kumoko. Thank you. Oh, that's, that's what she looks like to their eyes. Mm hmm. Oh, too easy, man. Too easy. Oh, bye bye. Dead, 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 dead. Yep, evil eye. Let's go. Evil eyes. Ha ha ha. That's what you did back to normal now. <laughs> Dude, you're nothing like that. Jesus Christ. No. Ew. Yeah, exactly. Heal? Yep, heal. Oh, how nice of her, man. How nice of her. <laughs> Again? <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> oh. Oh. No way. What? No wonder I look so... She's a vampire. Wait, is she reincarnated or something? Is she like one of the classmates? Yeah, I think she's reincarnated from your classmates or something. <laughs> you want to be a vampire? No. What? Come on. The spider works, I guess. Hey, you're gonna have an arcane form soon, okay? You're gonna be an, you're gonna have an arcane form soon, so stop arguing, man. <laughs> That's what she looks like. From that. <laughs> and she's crying and runs away. Sure, why not? I guess she's jealous of the vampire form. Wow. Okay, what now? Oh, what's going on here? Oh, elves. Okay, interesting. Oh, so they're after the baby. Oh, of course, of course they are. Well, Kumoko be the hero of the day and save them again, I guess. I think now she pities her. Yeah, she pities her now. <laughs> oh, she actually... Oh my god! Yo, she actually killed her! Oh, shit! Wait, wasn't she held captive or something? Um, I must be remembering something wrong here. Oh, it's a trap, isn't it? It's a trap. Yep, it's a trap. Oh! Yeah, no! Oh my god, what the hell is going on? Sorry. Oh! Oh! You should be mind control or something? What the hell? Oh my god. Oh my. What? What the hell is going on? What the fuck is going on? Oh my god. It has to be some sort of like misunderstanding. Oh my god, it has to be his doing, isn't it? It has to be his doing. What the hell is going on? Retaliation? Rebellion? What the hell? Oh my god, of course, it has to be has to be retaliation or something shit like that. Oh, that's why. Oh, wow. Wow, 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 wow. I mean, it's royalty, jealousy, what do you expect, man? Oh my god, so this stuff happens too, and he's helping them. 
Why is your sister want her to die? Him to die now? What the hell is going on? Did he did he do something to her? They gotta do something to Sue. Like she's. I knew it. I knew it. Brainwash. Oh yo, let's go, let's go, man. Let's go. Oh, oh, okay, yo. Let, oh, who's that? Oh my god, who's that? Wait, is she the one? Oh my god, she's the one from that manip that manip manipulated him. Sophia, wait, Sophia? Wait, as in Sophia, of the, as the, the vampire from? Oh, no way. And she's been voiced by Ayana. I recognize that voice anyways. Oh, ho ho, wait, who casted that? Oh, Sensei. Hey, let's run for it. <laughs> wow, damn, Sensei is so strong, man. I mean, getting out is the only option right now. There's nothing you can do right now. Rebellion. <laughs> oh boy. Retaliation, rebellion. Wherever you can say it. Oh shit. Are they brainwashed or something? Oh yeah, I think they're brainwashed. Alright. Oh, what? Who's supporting them now? Damn. What a, what a chaotic start, man. What a chaotic second half of the season, indeed. Now I am loving it. Well, I mean, seriously, why is it always the church, man? Why does it always have to be the church in Isekai world to be the villains? Seems like this whole mind control thing now is going to be a big threat to them right now. So they need to be careful who to trust. Oh, so seems like... Oh, ho, 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 yo, Sophia, man. Yeah, she's a big threat now. The vampire girl. Wow, it seems like they're right, right for bad. Oh, I, 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 of course, she, of course, man. Of course, she's been mind controlled. Oh my god, the pain, man. The pain of fighting your own good friend. Oh boy. Oh my god, don't, don't even try to use top no jutsu, man. Seriously, don't even think about it. Oh, okay. He cannot kill her. Dude, hesitation, man. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh my god, what are you gonna do? Get her to wake up? No, she's tricking you. The idiot. Oh, there we go. Hesitation. Let's go. Hesitation. Oh, kill me now before I come back to normal. Ah, oh, here you go. Back to normal now. Oh, she gonna do her as that was or something? Oh, ho, 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 ho. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Oh, my God. What the hell, man? Yo. No, ho, ho. Not his lover, I think. Hey, what the hell? Oh, my God. Don't tell me he has some healing magic or something. Hey, she's back. Aha. Oh, hey, let's go, Sensei. Let's go. Come on, show them how it's done. Oh, she's here. Oh, fuck, she's here. The vampire girl's here. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Yikes. We're not in Japan anymore. Yep, she's in reincarnated, all right. Oh, she's having too much fun or he or whatever. Jesus Christ, man. The vampire is super strong. Holy shit. Oh my god, Jesus, Sophia, my god. Oh, oh, ho, 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 ho. Oh boy, bad timing. Oh, the dragon. Oh, hey. Yes, her evolution, man. Holy shit, that is some crazy form. Well, guess they can find a way to escape now. Let's go, let's go, man. <laughs> oh, ho, ho. Distraction. Let's go. Grab onto my hand. Yeah, just like that. <laughs> I mean, I'm glad that some they managed to escape safely. I guess. I mean, blame the demon lord. I guess she is basically working with the demon lord. Yeah, demon lord. Of course, she is working with the demon lord. Well, 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 well. It seems like we got a very troublesome. Well, demon lord army servant or whatever or just a commander and guess it's the baby that kumoko saved 15 years ago too and look how much she matured man in 15 years damn now that is some nice body bet by the way and she's been voiced by ayana which is you know the voice actor of nino and stuff like that so oh my god dude she cancels magic that's almost like kumoko's magic man oh my god dude wait by any chance is Kum did kumoko like adopt her or something and and train her or maybe like you know like remember this she was still a baby at this time and kumuko basically saved her from elves and bandits so yeah kumuko basically maybe sooner or later become her guardian that's how she kind of knew about you know magic cancellation and stuff like that um yeah or maybe that's just part of her magic 
I feel like that's just, just part of magic and Kumiko and she's just a very special being and just like Kumiko reincarnated into this world and just, you know, be a vampire. Although how did she end up, you know, in Demon Lord Realm? Maybe like, you know, Demon come out come after her for her powers or her, for her vampire species. Or maybe, you know, uh, something happened to the family and Kumiko rescued her and then they come across the Demon Lord. And so, yeah, something or maybe something like that happened. But man, I gotta say though, the De demon lord got him got himself some interesting companions to to serve under him, and especially the fact that Kumiko potentially could be the one. How I mean, you can pretty much tell that the white girl lady is Kumo is kind of like Kumiko is going to guarantee to be Kumiko anyways. You, you know, she'll be helping out with demon lord, and yeah, how did these two end up in, in the De in demon lord's uh, like commanding um round off uh, round table? So. Man, there's many questions you're gonna say from 15 years ago and what what could happen to these two and how they end up the situation. But well what can I say? I feel like you know Kumiko will end up maybe adopting her and you know taking her in her custody and you know just protecting her and then come across the demon lore and they will and then end up in demon lore brown or something like that. Because you can just tell from the opening that the uh, Kumiko will come face to face with the demon lord. So, hmm, yeah, Kumiko became a hero. I mean, she just saved them because of the baby, to be honest, she didn't care less. And I like the fact how we just, you know, she, we can we get to see the perspective of what they see of Kumiko, like what, what she looks like <laughs> to their eyes, just like, you know, some spiders just messing around. But yeah, you can say that Kumiko be uh, just, you know, became a hero for, for the time being. But then you get some interesting, painstaking situation. I mean... You can't see it coming anyways. You just expected something like this gonna happen sooner or later anyways. So, I mean, I, I wasn't expecting mind control. That's for sure. So, I guess the mind control all comes from maybe the vampire girl, I guess. Because I, I doubt that she has abilities of mind control. So, maybe Sophia, the vampire girl, is gonna be a, one of the biggest threats for Shun right now. Sleep brainwash. I mean, kind of sad though. The sister is brainwashed, and of course, his Katia too. But I'm I'm glad that Katia able to fight through it. But maybe because Sue has a weak is weak minded, that's why she find it hard to fight through it. But man, Sophia, man, damn, what she had literally become one of a bad. She became a, such a badass demon lord companion, man. <laughs> and she even killed this uh, this guy too. Oh my god, things are not looking for good, for good for Shun's side, but you know, Demon Lord's side is having too much fun right now. I'm pretty sure Shun will find ways to re avenge, avenge the father, and you find ways to attack by the Demon Lord. You can just, I, I mean, you can just go to the opening and just see, see from there that it'll be, Shun will get some spotlight. I mean, why do you think the end the opening with Shun? So I'm pretty sure Shun gonna have some sort of like, um, as I say, hero rising, I would say, just to go and save, uh, uh, reclaim the kingdom from, well, you know, the first up here is the fight of Sophia. I mean, she, good God, she has some nice looking legs, but her attitude though is very evil, man. A very demon lord, evil minded person indeed. Oh my God. Uh, for, a second, uh, for a second, I was hoping that, you know, Kumiko would be the one who come and fight them, you know, the, uh, by the way, who's that hooded girl? Hmm. Who's that hooded girl? Is that another one of those demon lord servant, or is that just a uh, you know Sophia's uh, right hand man, a uh, right hand woman? I mean, she's wearing a skirt anyways. So, hmm. Well, a lot of question, man. A lot of question. I, I mean, things are getting heated up now. Things are really, really getting interesting. So, damn. I I can't wait to see what to come for for our lovely team and see what they can accomplish now from now on. So with that said, I hope you guys enjoy my reaction today. Make sure you guys smash the button in your reaction. Subscribe to channel room 10. See you next time. Thank you guys. Stay.